Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video I'm going to help you out on how to stock your fish tanks. I currently have four types of fish tanks and every single one of them are different in their own way and what types of fish go into those tanks. So I hope this video helps you out. So the first tank I'm going to talk about is my 20 litre beta tank. Um, I tend to keep him on his own purely because he shows far too much aggression towards any other fish. Typical fish you would not keep with a beta fish are fish like guppies. You will tend to get away with platys, neons, all types of fish like that. But this one here I just keep solitary on its own because he's far too aggressive towards any type of fish I tend to put in. So, this tank is my 40 litre tank and it's a very simple setup. As you can see, black substrate, few rocks and live plants and it's ran by sponge filter. In the tank I currently stock in platys and guppies and they get along absolutely fine. The only thing I would say about this tank is with the platys they tend to make quite a lot of mess due to pooping everywhere so I would highly recommend water changes around once a week and make sure you siphon the gravel but apart from that this is a very easy tank to maintain and zero aggression. So this is where it gets really really complicated as this is a 250 litre tank so you really need to do your background and a lot of research if you're going to make it a community tank which I have here. For example if I wanted to stock angelfish into this tank all my neon tetras would have to be removed as they just won't go together. The angelfish will attack them as they are quite an aggressive type of fish and the neons are small enough to be hurt by them. So all it takes when you're setting up a tank and you want to make it a community tank is to sit down and look and do a lot of research on what types of fish you want into this tank, the community tank, and make sure you don't put nothing in there what just says a no-go area or else it can be quite cruel to your fish. So here we have it, this is my 64 litre tank and this is really really well balanced to me, um, a little bit of experiments were going on as I said previously, you wouldn't want to put angel fish with any other types of fish they could really harm and I've got penguin tetras in here and they seem to get on very very well, I've got three rummy nose tetras which were left from when I moved house and I just threw them into this tank and they've got on fine but this isn't the tank where the angels will stay as I said previously on the 250 the neons are going to come out and the angelfish will jump into the 250 as this is just a growing out tank for them so guys I hope this video has helped anyone like looking around to see what types of fish can go with what um, I really appreciate if you could give this video a big thumbs up and if you did like it please hit that subscribe button and help support the channel and I'll catch you in the next one